This is Pastor Rodney. You are not forgotten. You are not forgotten. I know oftentimes we feel like we pour ourselves into so many people, helping wherever we can. But then when we're in need, no one shows up. Even in today's time, with all that's going on around the world, it's so easy to think, God, what's going on? And have you forgotten us? In the word of the Lord in Psalms chapter 44, the sons of Korah says, Wake up, O Lord. Why do you sleep? Get up. Do not reject us forever. Why do you look the other way? Why do you ignore our suffering and oppression? We collapse in the dust, lying face down in the dirt. Rise up, help us, rescue us because of your unfailing love. Yeah, they understood how you may feel. In fact, David said these words in Psalms chapter 13. How long, Lord, will you forget me? Forever? How long will you look the other way? How long must I struggle with anguish in my soul, with sorrow in my heart every day? How long will my enemy have the upper hand? Turn and answer me, O Lord my God. Restore the sparkle to my eyes, or I will die. See, you're not alone. So many of us have gone through situations that make us feel like maybe we're forgotten. Maybe our problems are so overwhelming until there's no one to help us. In fact, Isaiah said, Jerusalem says the Lord has deserted us. The Lord has forgotten us. But listen what the Lord says. Never can a mother forget her nursing child. How can she feel no love for the child she has born? But even if it were possible, I will not forget you. See, I have written your names on the palm of my hands. Always in my mind is a picture of you in ruins. Listen, God has not forgotten you. And this is why I come to you now to remind you that Hebrews says, For the Lord is not unjust. He will not forget how hard you have worked for him and how you have shown your love to him by caring for other believers as you still do. And then in Deuteronomy chapter 4, it says, For the Lord your God is a merciful God. He will not abandon you or destroy you or forget the solemn covenant he made with your ancestors. You see, because you are fearfully and wonderfully made. See, God, God loves you and he can never forget that love. So every day you wake up, that's God saying, I remember you. Every day you take a breath to breathe, that's God saying, I remember you. Every beat of your heart is God saying, I remember you. For you are not forgotten. So today, if you're feeling like you are forgotten, know this, that I stopped by to tell you, you are not forgotten. So right now, just pause, reflect, and emerge into the life that God has given you. In Jesus' name.